Hey guys, so I hope you guys are doing fine. Today we'll be talking about fall on the outstretched hand, okay? And its effect on different age groups. Okay? Maybe like you are trying to fall down, then you are like um supporting the weight of your body with your hand. Okay? What is the effect if you are a child? What is the effect if you are an adult? And what is the effect if you are old? Okay? So fall on the hand or outstretched hand, okay? And its effects on different age groups. Right? So um let's move, guys. Um the force of a fall on the hand produces different effects in different age groups. Okay. Now, in a child, it may cause displacement of the distal radial epiphysis. Okay. In a child, just like um the radius, that that's the bone. I hope you guys should at least you have you guys should have your um what do they call it? Your atlas beside you anytime you are listening to my videos okay so if i'm talking about the radius you're actually looking at the radius okay so now in a child it may cause displacement of the distal that's the lower part of the radius okay how about in an adult um the shafts of the radius and ulna may fracture or the scaphoid may fracture you know the scaphoid is like part of the uh, carpal bones now take your atlas look at the scaphoid that bone might be ruptured. Now, take your atlas, look at the radius bone, and look at the ulna bone, okay? The shaft, that's the body, might be ruptured, okay? Then how about in an elderly person? Um, uh, the most likely results will be colless fracture, okay? This hand might be dislocated backward, okay? You guys are not seeing me. Your hand might be dislocated backward if you're an elderly person and you fall on an outstretched hand, okay? Now, uh, rebuild to be the most common fracture of the forearm, okay? A colless fracture is like the most common fracture of the forearm in elderly people, okay? That's the, that's the effect of falling on outstretched hand. The effect in children, effect in adults, effect in um, elderly people, okay? So that's it guys about this tutorial. Fun. And see you guys in the next tutorial. Bye for now.